Irony. Irony is a device used to express something by saying the opposite of what you mean. Like when you say in a flat tone after waiting an hour in the rain, thank you for being here on time. There are three types of literary irony. They are verbal, dramatic and situational. Verbal irony, like in the first example, is a rhetorical device where something said is obviously not what is meant. An example of this would be to say, what a lovely day, when everybody thinks it is the opposite. Dramatic irony is a literary technique used to create two levels of understanding. One for the characters and one for the reader. This occurs because the author has offered the reader more knowledge than the characters. An example would be a character expecting to win a car race, where we, as readers, have information that his car will burn up. Shakespeare's Romeo and Juliet is a classic example. At one point in the story, the reader is aware that these star-crossed lovers belong to rival families. While the lovers don't know this yet, the reader knows that their relationship is doomed, but the main characters still don't, hence the term dramatic irony. Situational irony occurs when an event ends in an unexpected way, whether positively or negatively. The irony is the difference between what should happen and what actually happens. There is often a certain element of coincidence in situational irony. An example of situational irony would be if someone with a peanut allergy won a year's supply of peanut butter. Or if a war photographer taken prisoner for ransom were to be photographed with his own camera.